the fossil stealing spree, and the Rhine Tower standoff case too. They even made a movie based on the R case. Yeah, I thought that movie was pretty good, but how come Mom and me didn't even show up in it? I have no idea, but movies usually do their own thing, don't they? Yeah, I guess. Oh, by the way. Tim, Tim. Hey, Tim. Jessica seems really grateful to us for solving the R case two years ago. Nice to know our hard work wasn't for nothing. Yo, Tim. What's up with you and Rachel, anyway? Just friends? Really? Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Sorry, but could you sit down for a sec? Hey, Growlithe, you don't have to beat yourself up over it so much. Don't worry. Just trust me. I'm a great detective. I promise I'll get it back. Say, Growlithe. I don't seem to be slowing you down at all. You don't think I'm heavy? That's a relief to hear. Uh, sorry, Growlithe, but could you stop for a sec? All this bouncing up and down is making me queasy. Hey, don't move so suddenly! Ah! You really get along with Dennis, huh? Why's that? Oh, yeah, I get it. Being ignored really hurts. Drop this! 
Did you just use Belch? Oh, this is bad! Let's get out of here, Tim! Missing jewel, and now Cramorant's full belly. What are you thinking, Pikachu? I figured it out. <laughs> ah, a bolt of brilliance. <laughs> the stolen jewel we seek is right over there. Everyone, thank you for coming. The sudden conference had better be important. It is. We've identified the real culprit. <gasps> Have you now? Yes, Mr. Barnes isn't the one who stole the jewel. Oh, oh. Who did it then? I'll explain everything from the beginning. I'm home. Tim's back! Well, you sure are home late. Good evening. Oh, and who is this? My classmate, Rachel. It's nice to meet you. Is she your girlfriend? Huh? If only... <laughs> yep? Right. Dinner's ready, everyone. <laughs> well, I should probably get going. Come now, why don't you stay and eat with us? Yeah, that's a great idea. Well, you heard them. Uh, what do you say? I mean, who could turn down an invitation like that? Eat up, everyone. I really outdid myself this time. Wow, looks amazing. Thank you, Mom. Mom made her special mac and cheese for us. So this is the dish that Harry kept raving about, huh? <laughs> oh, this is incredible. Good, huh? Hmm. <laughs> Hey, feeling better? Yeah, I guess. Pikachu. Huh? What's that? Mewtwo! You too! There is something the two of you must know. When I was in my cave a few days ago, I was attacked by several Pokémon. Yeah, we saw on the news. 
No matter how many times I overpowered them, they didn't seem to feel a thing. Maybe R again? No. These Pokémon had no will of their own, as if something was controlling them. As for Harry... Harry? Like the one we saw in Cramorant. You think the two are related somehow? I'd say, almost certainly. Finding the Aurora Drop may be the key to solving this mystery. Yeah, let's follow up on that. <laughs> the the Cramorant that stole the Aurora Drop. The swarm of Beedrill that attacked Mewtwo. They both had glowing devices stuck to them. After hearing Mewtwo say my dad's name, I think if I investigate the Aurora Drop, that I might get closer to finding him. Yep. Hey, Tim. Pikachu. He seems kinda odd, don't you think? What do you mean? He is, isn't he? I've never seen a Pikachu that drinks coffee before. Dad, you have a good eye for detail. Yep. Slow. Don't worry, we'll pull you free. Three, two. <laughs> Almost there. No. Rachel! Come on, quit playing around. Wait, huh? Uh-oh. Isn't this Slowpoke's tail? Hey, are you okay? Slow. Well, I see. Your tail really grows back fast. Slowpoke, Slowpoke. I can keep this? Don't mind if I do. Slowpoke. Lobo? Just step, Tim. It's uh, slippery here. Well, I'll see you later. Just be careful. All right? Ah, oh, really? I should have seen this coming. Don't just stand there! Help me out of here! Wait, just so we're clear, I do not want you to kick me! You want me to kick you? Okay! Pikachu! 
get you. The rest is up to you. Good grief. What? Ugh. I can't believe I ended up getting trapped in a place like this. Hey! I've got to at least tell him that we're here to rescue him. Hey! Hey! Hmm? Uh, don't worry. We're here to help. <laughs> A Pikachu? Where'd you come from? Are you dancing? Right. This will be just perfect. Sure. Hey, Darmanitan! Over here! Got something for you. Better hurry before I eat it all up. Here, it's yours, Ida. Pikachu! <laughs> Looks like it worked at least. Yeah, all's well that ends well. Ready, Darmanitan? I'm counting on you! Now we're talking! Okay, let's go! Darmanitan! Slow. Oh, Slowpoke, there you are. Slowpoke, 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 Slowpoke. Slowpoke. The puzzles and the murals. Also, a maze with a dead end. What are you thinking, Pikachu? Of course! It all makes sense now! A bolt of brilliance! There's a mechanism on the other side of this wall! Oh! <laughs> Give it!
Give it what for, Darmanitan! Manitan! Magnificent. What a sight. Let's ask Ice Q to help. Ice Q? I see. I hadn't thought of that. Huh. You've got this, Ice Q! Thank you, Tim. Hey, maybe you should come to my class as a guest lecturer. <laughs> oh, love to see that. Yes. Yes. Hold on. I heard someone talking I'm behind sorry. us. I mean, huh? Yes. I, I'm sorry, sir. You've let those ice Pokemon escape? You're getting sloppy! W we did retrieve the meteorites. Then get back here! Now! I swear, could that guy be any boss here? <laughs> hmm? <gasps> Nat? Oh, <laughs> Detective Pikachu! Bring you and earn me some respect. Listen up, pal. Hand over that Pikachu and I'll let you walk out of here. You say? Are you really sure threatening us is a good idea? After it now! Alright! Finally out of there. P Professor, you're okay. Chris, sorry to worry you. Hmm. 
<laughs> What's oh. that? Huh? Look. Huh? Hey, up there! Mew too? Huh? What's that behind it? There's something wrong. Yeah! Oh no! Oh no! They're coming this way! Everyone, take cover now! What just happened? Why did you have Harry? Terrible. Pokemon battling in the city? It's just like Mayor Myers told us. Pokemon have to be managed. This is not good. You need to get out of here. So it would seem. Do not worry about that human. Tim, does Pikachu actually know Mewtwo? You could say that. That's incredible. I guess, but where'd those guys take my dad? How can I get my father back? There must be something I can do. With all the unrest gripping the city, the police have got to know something. Of course. I'll just talk to Inspector Holiday. He's bound to know something useful. Uh, uh, what's this? Hello, great detective. I'm here for Pikachu. W Brad, what is all this? Pikachu, you're under arrest. Come with us. Huh? <laughs> no way. Arrested for what? For property damage. Take him away. <laughs> oh, Tim, I'll be all right. It's just a misunderstanding. Focus on proving my innocence! Pikachu!
This is bad. It's time for exercise. Proceed to the roof. Single file. Hey, you guys all right? Body's moving on its own. That light. happened supposed to be the big boss of this place? You gotta be joking. <laughs> like Jail 101 or something? Tim, I thought I'd find you here. Inspector Holliday. And Chief Butler. I understand how concerned you are about your Pikachu. Don't worry, the Pokémon Protection Bureau is a safe place. Hmm. Tim! Pikachu! Thank goodness. You really had me worried. Hey, keep your voice down. Don't call attention to us. Oh, uh, right. Mm hmm. You'll get out soon. Just hang in there. Time's up. Hold on! We're not done yet! What's wrong, Pikachu? My body's moving on its own. Huh? That light? Hmm. 
Luxray, let's do this. Come on, can someone give me a little help? Whoa, not like that! Oh. Let's go, Luxray! Right. Man, you are so cool! Hey, Luxray. If you can see through walls, you can see all kinds of things, right? I guess that means you've got an eye for detail. <laughs> I'll see myself out. Looks rain. Rachel, there's something I want to tell you. What is it? It sounds pretty serious. I don't expect you to believe me, but the truth is... I can understand everything Pikachu says. Goes nothing. Ugh, why are they all so high up? <gasps> oh no, someone's coming. Let's hide there. Please, come in. Thanks to your information, the jewel is now in my possession. As for the matter of that woman and Pikachu... That Pikachu's being transferred tomorrow. Detective had and all. I see. I won't tolerate any mistakes. <clears throat> if you'd like more money, deal with that woman for me, too. Leave it to me, sir. Now that, I'd like to see how things are progressing with the control cubes. <laughs> yes, sir. <sighs> that guy Butler met with, who could he be? He said I'm getting transferred tomorrow. Pito. Sounds like we better hurry. This is bad. This whole time, I've been trying to figure out why I ended up in this place. But unfortunately, I have no idea. 
Hey, you! Don't just stand there doing nothing. Bring me a cup of coffee or something. Ah, oh, man, the service in this place stinks. Can't even get a cup of coffee around here. Pokemon Protection Bureau, my foot. I swear, we'll get out of here. Hey, Tim. Sorry I kept you waiting. Pikachu. You're okay. Impossible. Why are Pikachu and Luxray here? Detain them already, Brad! Pikachu's coming home with me. Because the real culprit behind all this... is you, Chief Butler. I'm the culprit? Ha! What's gotten into you all of a sudden? Your partner is the one who destroyed the Slowpoke statue. You can walk your way out of this. You're just playing innocent. Tim, be sure to start off strong. You never stood a chance against us, Butler. Wonderful work, Tim. Thanks. Pikachu, you were amazing too. I owe you two big time. Anyway, now you can finally get out of here. Yeah, and I could really go for some coffee after this. That was great detective work, Tim.
On behalf of the Rhyme City Police, you have our sincerest gratitude. Lieutenant. Now, Chief Butler, please hand over the controller. What's going on? It's broken! There goes our proof. Well, that's just great. Well, Chief, no, Butler. I've got a lot of questions for you. Now, come with me. Blinded by cash, he lost sight of the path of justice. Yeah. So, you'll take care of dinner tonight? Yeah, no problem. It won't be anything special, though. Oh, I still need to get Sophia. Hey, Irene! You dropped your ring! Right, she can't understand me. Oh, well. This is Harry's re- <laughs> Well... It's done. It's the right choice. I did what's best for my family. Me? Even if it makes me the bad guy. If I told her the truth, Irene... She never agreed to a divorce. <laughs> You're the only one I can confide in, Pikachu. Pika Vega. This was his ring. When your father left, he didn't take it with him. Are you getting a divorce? No way! Don't worry. We're not. He may have said that's what he wanted. But when he said it, he couldn't bring himself to look me in the eye. He always does that when he's hiding something. I'm sure he got involved in some sort of incident. So he pushed us away to make sure his family stayed clear of any danger. Mom... Looks like Unitas has their next target. Rachel's friend, Jessica. Tomorrow, we'll go to Bamboo Burrow. And make sure Jessica is safe. And if she has any information about Unitas, 
That'll get us closer to solving this case. Yep. How did you like the coffee I made? Well, uh, let me see. Oh, you made that coffee? Thanks, Sophia. She had her heart set on making coffee for Pikachu and was practicing it all day. You were pretty worried about him, huh? Well, of course I was worried. Pikachu is family. Thanks, Sophia. That was the best coffee I've ever had. Hey, mind if I join you? What do you think? I'm a natural, huh? Hey, wait! Where are you going? Huh? Is that? Jump... Hey! You okay? Pikachu! Oh. Pika Vega! Pika! Pika! Easy, easy! I'm not gonna try anything. You're protecting your friend, aren't you? Whoa! Uh, sorry! Sorry! Hmm. Okay. Wait, look. I swear, I'm just trying to help your friend. That's all. Okay. There, there. Sit tight for a second. You'll feel better after you eat this. <laughs> Tastes bad, huh? You know it's working. Seems like you're doing a lot better. Now, the question is, who would do such a thing to Pancham? <laughs> that cry. Hmm. Be this way. Hmm. For a lift?
Thanks, bud. Yeah! Now we're unstoppable! Pangaro, let's go! What is it? Oh, I know. You're hungry, aren't you? Okay. Thanks, buddy. Pikachu! <laughs> Great job, Pikachu. Pikachu! Pikachu! Hmm. Pika Pika! What is it? I get it. You want to touch my beard. Nice job. Hey, are you okay? Looks like those jerks were using you. Huh? What's this? A vial? Of brilliance! Big I have been going berserk, and this stuff is why. Big Big exactly. You think so too? 
If this gets out into the world, it'll be a disaster. But I will not let that happen. Thanks for all your help, buddy. Bye now. Come? Pikachu! Well then, you can have this. Looks great on you. Pikachu! Right, let's go. Pikachu! Wake up, Pikachu! <sighs> You're a real powerhouse, Pangoro. Have you been this strong since you were little? Well, that sure wasn't convincing. Don't forget, you're dealing with a great detective. You're hiding something, aren't you? Wow. Great. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm fine too. Pikachu, you say you got the hat from my dad, but you also gave it to Pikachu? That's right. How strange. I'm starting to remember more. This whole thing started with that car accident. I remember driving my car that day with my partner, Pikachu. Suddenly, the brakes failed and we crashed in a valley. And then I... I got thrown out of the car. Everything started to fade, and I blacked out. All I remember is Pikachu desperately crying for help. But, of course, these memories up to that point were Harry's. What is the matter? You do not appear to be injured. It is too late for him. He's fading as we speak. You would go that far. I will need your physical form to save him. Even I cannot say for certain what will happen. Knowing this, do you still wish to save him? Very well. However, I have one condition. My cells are being used by some humans for nefarious ends. I want you to retrieve them for me. The fate of this human rests in the strength of your bond with him. Now. Anyway, that's what went down between me and Mewtwo. It sounds to me like Dad and Pikachu had a really strong bond. Yeah. 
By the way, Tim, don't you want to know what me and Mewtwo talked about after the ER incident? Huh? Do you remember what happened then, too? Yeah, I remember it like it was yesterday. Crystal clear. After we solved the R case, I went out to that alley to meet up with Mewtwo. Here you are, just like I promised you. Indeed. Thank you. So, that means it's my turn now. Before we proceed, there is something we must discuss. Oh yeah? Don't tell me you can't do it now. Right now, Pikachu's consciousness and your human consciousness coexist within you. It is a miracle that this balance has endured as long as it has. I can only imagine that your trust in one another has made this possible. If I were to forcibly separate the two... You're saying you can't guarantee that I'd survive that? Correct. I would say you have a 50% chance of survival. Hmm. We don't have much time. Have you decided on which one to choose? Yeah, I've made up my mind. I'll take my chances with that 50%. So be it. Hey, mm -hmm. wait a second! When you say I might not survive, do you mean just me, or Pikachu, too? Your fate and Pikachu's are inextricably intertwined. Then I can't afford to leave this up to chance. Sorry, can you wait before making me human again? Please. I'm sure Tim will figure something out. Besides, I'd like to be here and watch him grow up. I'm sorry, Tim. Can't come home just yet. Very well. However, because you used a move earlier, you are now in a precarious situation. If your human consciousness remains this strong, Pikachu's will disappear. Then, what can I do? I will restore the balance between your consciousnesses, and you will forget what you now remember. Amnesia again? Hey, wait! If you do that, how am I supposed to tell Tim I'm... All this time I've been looking for my dad, and all along, you've been right beside me. I'm sorry. I should have realized it sooner. You think that's why we could understand each other? Yeah, that really should have been our biggest clue, huh? After all, you're my own flesh and blood. You've really grown up, Tim. <sighs> You finally found me. Thank you. So, what do I call you now? Should I call you Dad? Hmm? I mean, you're my dad, but you're a Pikachu, too. <laughs> yeah, it'd be weird if someone overheard you. Pikachu is fine for now. Huh? Just until I'm back to normal. Yeah, sounds good to... I mean, Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> I'd better get back to normal soon, for everyone's sake. Thanks to my strong bond with Pikachu, Mewtwo was able to save his life. But our work isn't finished just yet. The name of Emma's project was Unitas, the same name as the organization. We need to investigate the Unity Lab next. Right. Yep. Pikachu seems different from his usual self. Different how? It just seems like he's got, I don't know, old man energy now. 
What? Really? He's always seemed like that to me. <sighs> uh, not old. Experience. Like an experienced great detective. Am I really acting older since I got my memories back? Okay, there's something I gotta do. I'll meet you there. Wait, what? <laughs> You'll like it, I promise. Oh, that's right. We're out of coffee beans. Can you pick some up? Okay. The usual dark roast, right? Yeah. Huh? huh? Sophia, you can... Uh-huh. I've understood you this whole time. <laughs> now that's my little girl! Ah, uh, we don't have time for this. Okay, okay, okay. See you later. Call him dad to his face. I mean, he still looks like a Pikachu. When you put it like that, it does sound awkward. There he is! Hey! Sorry for the wait! You all came to help. Thank you. Wow, Pikachu, you have so many friends. This ragtag crew is my entourage. Whoa, what? Did I miss something? Oh, Pikachu said... That... Tim, there's no time for that. We got work to do. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? What in the world? Is that a tail? All oh, right, I'm a Pikachu. Is there a hole here? Oh, oh no! Hey, sweet! They dropped their card key! Okay. Whoa! Run for it! Hey, wait! Stop! <laughs> Hey, why'd you stop? What'd you say? Hey, Growlithe, what are you doing? What? Pikachu, Growlithe's buying us some time. I'll come back for you, I swear! This is bad. Look, Ray, thank you. Come on, let's go! Pikachu! <laughs> Uh, 
We're about to prove what a crook he really is. That's right. Hey, hey! What about my body? Oh, don't you worry. We haven't forgotten. Oh, well. Okay, then. Hey, look! It's Dad! We finally found me! Well... Empty. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> Rachel. Looks like the whole cast is here. We need to prove Murloc's deception and put a stop to his scheme. Yeah, but where do we even start? Tim Goodman, what are you doing here? I've been investigating a mysterious group. They're called Unitas. Investigating Unitas? Why are you doing that? Unitas has been causing some serious problems, Mayor Myers. Problems? What are you talking about? Papa, please listen! Mayor Myers, Unitas is a dangerous organization. But all they do is conduct research into Pokémon. I created Unitas for the benefit of Rhyme City. How could that be dangerous? On what basis do you make this claim? Residence? Yes, I did hear that the Aurora Drop was stolen the day after the award ceremony. That's right. And Unitas was involved in that incident. Excuse me? And I also have evidence that the Aurora Drop was brought here. How could that be? I'm sure that was just a few bad apples. You can't say the whole organization is dangerous just because of that. Actually, they've committed other crimes as well. And they even targeted us, too. Was that really Unitas? Everywhere we went, we kept getting attacked by Unitas. I'm sure that was just a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding? They even went after me and Jessica! Rachel, you too? Murloc, did you know about this? Yeesh, he's completely ignoring us. Please, Papa, you have to stop this! I can't do that. No. 
not when human Pokemon coexistence is so close to being achieved. The cubes are how you'll achieve that? Exactly. Pokemon can be dangerous at times, but the friendship cubes will solve that problem. Friendship cubes? Mayor Myers, those cubes are the problem. Do you have any idea how Pokemon have been harmed because of those cubes? The PPB incident. The case with Butler. I did hear about that. He was using one of those cubes to make a Pokemon commit crimes. He, what? Why would he misuse the cubes that way? Because of that, my Pikachu was wrongfully arrested. I nearly lost a member of my family because of those cubes. You've helped me understand how the friendship cubes could be dangerous. If they're misused, which is not enough of a reason to stop this operation. Papa! With the friendship cubes, humans and Pokémon can finally understand one another. Mayor Myers, can't you see you're being deceived? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Do the cubes really do that? The purpose of the cubes, in truth, is to deprive Pokémon of their free will and force them to do what humans want. I was told the friendship cubes were revolutionary devices that would allow humans and Pokémon to live in harmony. Mayor Myers, You've been deceived this whole time by the name Friendship Cube. They're actually called Control Cubes. Please, you have to stop this before it's too late. No, never. Even if it's all true, this was Emma's dream. You know this wasn't Mama's dream. Rachel. Papa, don't you remember when I was little and got lost in Bamboo Burrow and Ursa Ring saved me? I was afraid and crying, and since it was worried for my safety, the Ursa Ring chose to rescue me. All Pokémon have free will and can think for themselves, but you're trying to impose your will onto theirs. Do you really believe that's right? How can you claim to coexist with Pokémon if you take away their free will? Papa, is that really the future you want for Rhyme City? Because Mama's dream for people and Pokémon was nothing like this. And if she knew, if Mama saw this... You just can't do this, Papa! Rachel... I didn't realize what the friendship cubes were really doing. I see now that I was wrong. I'm sorry, Rachel. I nearly made a terrible mistake that couldn't have been undone. As much as I'd like to, we can't wrap this up just yet. There's one last problem to take care of. Yes. Who took advantage of my plan? Who could have done these things? There's only one person it could have been. It's time to expose the one pulling the strings, Tim. Yeah. Not it.
The one behind this? Mr. Murloc! You're the culprit! Uh, will you shut up? I have to say, I'm incredibly disappointed in you, Mayor Myers. You know you're playing right into Pokémon's hands, don't you? Rhyme City's a lost cause if you can't even protect your only daughter. What did you say? Go. Murloc! You were deceiving me?! Your role in this has come to an end, Mayor. As for the great detective duo, I knew you were good, but even I'm impressed you made it all the way here. Mr. Murloc, those cubes will never be used again. Give up already. <laughs> <laughs> you really think I care about that plan? It was nothing more than a means to an end. Hold! This is the masterpiece that I've truly been creating. Y you mean, this has nothing to do with the cubes? We saw the meteorite and the aurora drop in the lab. Do those have something to do with my dad and Pikachu? Excuse me? You dared to snoop through my research? <laughs> Common rabble like you wouldn't understand it anyway. Explaining it would be pointless. Just pay attention. Pay attention? I've got a bad feeling about this. You guys! You're all right! <gasps> Here they are. Huh? Pikachu! Huh? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? But why, Pangoro? Uh, Tim, look! <gasps> of course, they're all being controlled. to get the show started! <laughs> I believe you may recognize this. The Aurora Drop? What are you... What are you gonna do with that? Easy. Professor Gordon said about the Pokemon from space? <laughs>
Pikachu! Murloc! Let him go! Oh, I've come too far to stop now. The sleeping man and Detective Pikachu both brought me the energy I need. The energies come together as one. All of my research, all of my dreams, will finally become reality! Just... Yes! This is the answer! How can a person become a Pokémon? How horrifying. The best way for humans to understand Pokémon is for them to become Pokémon themselves. A union of human and Pokémon. This is the true meaning of coexistence! Well, what are you waiting for? As you can see, weaklings like you aren't even worth my time. Gotta do something. But first, I need to help Pikachu. <clears throat> What's that? I cannot imagine why, but I sense a human's presence within that Pokémon. Tell me, what has happened? That guy used the energy in Dad and Pikachu to become... Deoxys! Is that so? Not only has he misused my energy, he is using a Pokémon for his... <laughs>
have to do something. The slab's gonna collapse before either one of them wins. We need to get somewhere safe. That's it! Rachel, Mr. Myers, take shelter in the elevator. But, Tim... I'll save Pikachu. Okay, Growl and the others might be hurt. I'll take care of them. Come on, Papa, let's go! Right. Tim, you be careful. I will. Pikachu! Oh, wow, that was intense. But looks like both me and Pikachu are okay. What a relief. I gotta say, looks like the party's in full swing. Believe it or not, it's Murloc. Yeah, I know. Looks like he's become a Pokemon. We have to stop him somehow. I can't imagine Mewtwo losing. But we humans caused this mess. We're the ones who've got to clean it up. Yeah. What about your body? I look safe enough in there. Anyway, let's hurry. You okay? Yeah. Nothing's changing. Well, maybe removing the excess energy didn't do anything because they're already fused together. Think, Tim. There has to be another way. Wait a minute. Murloc wrote about the energy in that report of his we uncovered. That's right. What exactly did Murloc use that energy for again? No, that's not right. That's it! If Murloc used that energy to fuse himself with Deoxys, then maybe that's the key to separating them! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What are you going on about? 
Murloc and Deoxys are fused together because of that energy. According to the report, the balance of that energy is crucial. Oh, so we just gotta disrupt that balance! Yeah, but how do we do that? No, that won't work. If we can somehow expose the access to these two energies... That excess energy will throw off the balance! But how do we do that? Once we figure that out, we can get back at him for throwing me into that pod. Deoxys flying around, the busted fusion machine, and then there's me, the great detective Pikachu. What are you thinking, Pikachu? Aha! I think I've got it! A bolt of brilliance! I'll jump up from the top of this machine and hit Deoxys with the energy! Oh, how very thoughtful. <sighs> Time to close this case! Take the elevator. I should be able to get over there. Okay, hand him over, Tim. Yeah. There. Hmm. Looks like we're ready to go. So, hit it! Deoxys in midair with two capsules of energy? You do that. Only I can do this. Yeah, I know. It's just, isn't there another way? Come on. Who do you think I am, Tim? In all my cases, I've never given up. I'm the great detective Harry Goodman! We've gathered all the evidence we need. Now all we gotta do is use it to pin down the culprit. Please, be careful. Just leave this to me. Wait, what are they doing? If they unleash those moves, this place will explode! I've got to hurt. Get this done. Just need our body to hold out for me. Such a 
insignificant. We did it. Pikachu! Come on! You've got to hurry! I can't. I've used up all my strength. I can't make it. You need to go on without me. But, Dad... Get them to safety. Don't wait up for me! Hang in there. We're almost out of here. Irene and Sophia. They need you. Tim, you've grown into a fine young man. And one heck of a great detective. Pikachu. Save him. Dad or Pikachu? Tim. What? Dad! Tim, hey. Sorry I kept you waiting so Dad! long. I... <laughs> Easy now. You're gonna break my ribs. I'm so glad you're okay. Pikachu, too. Yeah. Little guy's sound asleep. He really did a great job back there. Yeah. That was me, you know. Half you, maybe. <laughs> That's fair. Come on. Everyone's waiting. Let's go home. Yeah.
Aw, come on, Dad. Please, take me on a case. I think I'd make a great detective. I don't know. You get bored really fast. Hey, what's that got to do with it? Sophia, you're still young, and detective work is dangerous. Aww. Go on, Harry. Tell her what it's like. Uh, Sophia, the thing about being a detective is... I could take your calls! Oh, maybe. Harry! Pick up?